Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to talk to you about how to update to Windows 10 May Update 21H1 or whatever stupid numbers they're putting on it this time around. Let's talk about something different. Although we're talking about how to update to Windows 10 May Edition, it's really super easy to do. Let's talk about how not to update it, just so you know. One of the things you can do is you can pause it. So, for example, you go to Start, Settings, Update, and Security. But it's very limited what you can do with it now. Here you'll find your advanced options. And you can pause the updates here for maybe a week. And that's about it. So another way to do it is stop updates 10 and look for the I or read the video description to follow through the website to download this. Just click portable installer or from major geeks. There is a video tutorial there as well to show you how to use it. This works much, much better. If you download the portable app, you don't have to install anything, and it's easy. So there's the reverse of what the video is about, how to stop it. So let's talk about how to update it. We're going to do what we did before. Start, settings, up, oops, update and security. And check your date, what time is it checked lately, and then go ahead and click check for updates if you want. Now, if you don't see it, I probably wouldn't do anything. A lot of these major updates, if there's a driver issue and you have that particular piece of hardware, sometimes it gets put off for a week or two, and it's not the worst thing in the world to let it go. The world's not going to change because you don't have the particular large feature update right away, and you're probably going to cause yourself problems. But those of you who want to do it anyway, you can do it kind of the hard way, but basically this is it. Get it at Windows Update or wait for it. Microsoft Media Creation Tool. It's free. It's portable. You can download it here, and guess what? There's a video for that, too. How you can make a bootable ISO. Or how you can install directly from the Media Creation Tool. It's pretty easy to do. You can see right here. Upgrade it now. Or create installation media. If you don't want to download that, once again, that's why I give you the link to the page, you can download an ISO image. There's a bunch of different ways to do that. One of my favorites is tricking your web browser, Google Chrome, Firefox, Microsoft Edge, and they all work about the same. I think we hit F12 for developer tools, and we'll end up coming here and fooling it into thinking it's an iPad Pro, for example. And once you do that, you can refresh the page Let's see here real quick. Why not? We're here, right? See if I can remember off the top of my head. Device toolbar. Let's call it an iPad Pro. Let's refresh the page. Is that all I have to do? Oh, we have to down go to the download page. I almost forgot that. That explains it. But anyway, it's pretty easy to do. Let's see if I can find it here. Let me close this out. There you go. Let me get over to there. So let me show you real quick. You're actually going to load a page and do that. So it doesn't matter. One, You have one of these three web browsers. Let's take Google Chrome, which I'm using. We're going to go to the page, the download page. We're going to hit F12. iPad Pro. Once you have that set up, you can refresh this page. And as you can see, you can now download the update. Once you have that on your drive, you can actually extract the files and just run setup.exe, and it'll do the exact same thing as the media creation tool without having to download the media creation tool. Great little trick right there. So there you have it. That's the three ways, but if you want my opinion, it's a May update. You probably have it. If you don't, just give it a little time. I wouldn't go out of my way to rush to get it if it's not available on your Windows update yet. So there you have it. There's how to update or not to Windows 10 21H1 in May 2021. Bottom right corner, subscribe. Click like. We helped you out. Thanks for watching as always. See ya.